Hi, AT from CNC at home. With the wavy problem I've been having with the laser, I tried cutting some more items to see how they turned out. As you can see on the left, the letters are still wiggly and all kind of not the way they should be. On the right is something I did a couple weeks ago. That's how it should look. So there's still something wrong with the laser. What I'm thinking I'm going to try to do is remove the tape from the bottom of the rail and just let the gantry dangle like it was supposed to from the, from the manufacturer. I don't think this is going to work, but this is as close to basically factory spec as I'm going to be able to make it. And I'll start from there and then work my way forward again to see what uh, I can adjust to make it uh, work better. So let's see how this cuts now that I removed it. I'm checking for any extra tape that I missed. Everything seems good. The gantry seems to move nice and easily across. So that should be good, but you can see the wobble still. That's quite a bit. I'm gonna to try to do some burning on some cardboard just to save some of my tiles for a real project. I forgot to turn off the flood fill, so I know the burning is going to be a little bit weird because of that. But I'm looking for straight edges and I'm looking for things to be wobbly or not. At first glance, it seems to be doing okay. I'm going to burn something else. This is going to be something that I did uh, quite some time ago and it burned nicely in the wood. Again, at first glance, it seems to be burning quite nicely here on the cardboard as well. On closer examination, not all the curves are curving like they should be, but I'm thinking that could be the cardboard. I don't know. Let's try cutting something on a known material. We'll do an etch on the tile and see how that compares to the one that I did last time. Well, that turned out quite a bit better than the one I did last time. Almost as good as the one I did a couple weeks ago. This may have solved the problem. Let's do another burn to see what, uh, what waviness we might end up with. As we can see on the compass rose, we still have some waviness getting burned into it. So this didn't solve the problem. It just made it not quite as bad. I'm going to take the gantry off and I'm going to clean up the adhesive residue left over from the tape. I'm thinking this might be interfering with the smooth movement of the gantry. It's the only thing left um, that I can think of. With that cleaned off, the gantry moves nice and easily. Still, the gantry does wiggle back and forth. I'm hoping that its weight holds it in place. I'm going to burn the compass rose again. This time it's going to burn a little bit slower and using the black painted tile. Even at this slower speed, there's still some waviness in the burn, so this didn't solve the problem. When I was copying the images from my camera onto the computer, I found that uh, somebody had been looking at the camera and making some photos of their own. That was kind of funny. It made me laugh. Hi, I'm AT from CNC at Home. If you like our content, help support our channel by clicking on subscribe and liking our videos. Thank you for watching this video. Have fun with your CNC at Home projects.